In this video, we're running it back with the good old SDG44. I have a new build that's gonna be perfect. If you're looking to run and gun and outgun players at any and all range, this is truly one of the best assault rifles in the entire game. If that sounds good, feel free, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications. Let me know down in the comment section, what is your favorite AR to use here in Modern Warfare 3? All right, let's go ahead and create the new absolute best and fastest killing STG 44 class setup. This is going to be a fantastic build. If you're looking for a long range setup, you can run and gun with. Now, for the first attachment, we're starting off with the muzzle and like 99.9% .9 of assault rifle class setups. We are utilizing the quartermaster suppressor. This is a massive W, giving us improved recoil control, gun kick control, and taking us off the radar. We're going to need it on this class setup. This is going to be an attach you should definitely have unlocked for a majority of your Modern Warfare 3 weapons. Now, for the barrel, we are going to be mixing it up a little bit. We're going to be rocking the factory short barrel. This is going to be quite nice on the STG-44. If you're looking to run and gun with this weapon and use it on maps that are medium to short range, we have improved sprint to fire speed, gun kick control, as well as aim down sight speed. The cons are going to be completely relevant. The STG is still a hard hitting assault rifle, and we are still going to have fantastic recoil control with this class setup. Make sure you guys have this equipped. Now, for the underbarrel, unlike a lot of my STG44 builds, I do recommend putting on the jack slash this time. This truly comes in handy, especially if you're trying to run and gun, because we're going to get that one hit melee, which is honestly going to benefit you more often than you would think at those close range engagements. Considering the fact the spawns are so bad in this game, you kill somebody, run around the corner, they might be around that corner, and all you have to do is hit them one time with the jack slash, and we're going to have improved vertical recoil, sprint speed, as well as movement speed with this attachment. Overall, a great choice on the SDG44. We're not running ammunition, a magazine, a rear grip, but we are going to run a stock, and the DR-79 combo stock is a great choice. We're going to be bumping up that medium range performance with more firing aiming stability, recoil control, as well as gun kick control. Overall, a great attachment on the STG-44 you can't go wrong with on this universal class setup. And the final, we are going to utilize an optic. The iron sights on this weapon are not good, and the jet glasses is going to be amazing giving us not only a precision optic picture, but we have the ability of improved firing aiming stability and less visual recoil, which is going to be very important on any class setup, Modern Warfare 3 or Modern Warfare 2 weapons. I want you to go ahead and build this class. You're going to be very, very happy because in the firing range, we have an STG-44 setup that's going to have a lightning fast ADS. The aim walking speed is going to be nice. We're going to have that one hit melee and we still have controllable recoil and a fast TTK. You can't go wrong with this. This is going to be one of the better run and gun AR SMG hybrids. Now, for the remainder of the build, I do recommend putting on the Storm Ender with the Jack Volt Storm. This is the best secondary hands down. At close range, they're done. No hit markers. They're dying. This is going to be a great weapon to use. If you see more than one person rushing you, literally pull this bad boy out, charge it up, and blast them away. Now, for the remainder of the build, we are running the stem shot, munitions box, scavenger gloves, covert sneakers, the compression plate, bone conduction headset, as well as comms vest, which is going to be super important, giving you that 24-7 UAV every time you kill somebody and run over their body. They're dropping a radar beacon let you know exactly where everybody is at you can't go wrong with the stg overall a great assault rifle here in season six and one of my personal favorite weapons in the entire game you guys teared up with this class setup let me know down in the comment section and as always drop a like on the vid subscribe to the channel turn on those post notifications let's get in the game plays Right, let's get busy with the STG. We have a run and gun build we can use at longer ranges. I think you guys will definitely enjoy this setup. We're utilizing that jack slash, which is going to be a great attachment if you are trying to take people out. Honestly, at any and all ranges, we got that one hit melee, which is super, super convenient, as well as some recoil control, which you can't go wrong with. You guys are coming from all over. Get over here. Thought that guy trying to rotate back to the spawn. Not today. Hard 
Gotta get a flank. Somebody might be underneath me. Can we get a UAV? I saw you teammates. Got an overwatch. Got one more coming this way, I think. Oh, actually their whole team coming this way. Oh, this glass is nasty. Watch to save me. Thank you. Her entire team is back here. Enemies inside the perimeter. Switching back. Friendly Overwatch Halo inbound. Fast UAV is being good. I hit that guy with that jack slash right there. They should be spawning over there, honestly. Yeah, they're spawning out. Their entire team is spawning out right now. On a 19. Definitely popping this overwatch. Another advance. Oh, this is close. I am six away. This is actually a good hill. Oh, no. Technically, it's not because if we sit on this hill, it's going to be damn near. They're not going to. Well, actually, you know what? I think my teammates are. Looks like my teammate. Oh, I, I, I don't want to jinx it. Damn, we might run out of time. I died. Damn, bro. I was close to that joint. Let's get busy with the STG on Dome. I'm honestly not a huge fan of this map. I don't know. It's just kind of weird here in Modern Warfare 3. It's not the best, but it's also like not the worst. There's definitely worse maps. But I just feel like the rotations are just awkward on this map. Rotate over here. This is a good map to get camos done though. I will tell you that all the small maps are. Oh, did not see that coming. I love going ahead and getting on top of this, uh, the shipping crate over here. If my voice sounds kind of weird. I am a little bit sick. I don't know what's going on, but I'm a little under the weather. I was out last night and it is starting to kind of get cool. And I stupidly was out with short sleeves on. Huh. Crazy. Not doing that again. I think they should be spotting back over here in all reality, or at least in the bunker. Overwatch, 
Got an overwatch helo. Hold on, they might jump. Yep. Got a VTOL jet. Got the advance joint. I'm not gonna really mess with that. I'm gonna take the streaks out. Try to rotate back over here. They're all trying to take streaks out. Okay, that one guy looks like he's still okay. He's playing now. Cool. AFK players are the worst because all they do is mess up the spawns and cause people to appear where they should not be appearing. Okay, no, we have. They're trying to take my streaks out. I got a VTOL jet dropping down right on that location. Let me go ahead and put this overwatch back up. Stand up there. Ooh, Jack Slash just came in handy. Rotate this way. They should be spawning back over here. They should be back in. The yep. Oh my god. That kid cannot get lucky with that Magnum. Oh my god, it, it, you can't fire the shotgun when you're EMP'd. It makes sense though. Teammate, you're getting chased. He dropped the he dropped the DDoS device. Put that on the new hill. It makes complete sense though. that teammate that kids I don't want to push that I think he's in a corner with something Knife them. That dude, the jack, dude, the jack slap, bro. It's such a good setup, bro. Like that one hit melee. It's cheese, but it it just works. It literally just works. It just works. They're spawning. They're over here now. Oh, I didn't even notice that guy that was on top of the railing right there. I couldn't even see him. Can I see him from this? F Hold on. Ah, it's a little difficult. Get 
Come with that jack slash. Enemies inside the perimeter. Not coming from that way. I was ready for that flip spawn. Ordered himself. Hard point compromise. Secure the area. Rotate over here. Enemies inside the perimeter. Overwatch. Got a VTOL. Overwatch, or not Overwatch, excuse me. Have him push, have him push, have him push. I should have hit. I was literally like, oh man, he was he was just out of range too. I could have had maybe possibly could have had another one, honestly. Back over here. Once they get to 240, I gotta drop this. I got him off the hill. Other advance. I definitely 100% could have had another one. Gotta doubt my mind. Drop this VTOL. I'm about to drop this though. Man, it's a good thing I have this nuke. I'll tell you that right now. Yeah, I'm fucking EMP'd. I can't call. You can't use that. People are getting smart. They're using the EMP to stop you from calling in. Close to another one. I was real close to another one. We got 93. Hell yeah.